As you may have seen here on KUSI, Comic-Con has re-upped with with its more than 130,000 attendees and the tens of millions of dollars they spend along with local residents who flock to the gas lamp to be part of it all. So fresh off signing an agreement to stay in San Diego through 2024, Oh my God, it's gonna be unbelievable! County Supervisor Greg Cox recognized the pop culture phenomenon and all it's meant to the region, not just to the city. There's nothing to see here, move along. Comic-Con spokesperson David Glanzer standing with him in the supervisor's chambers. We have declared this day, the ninth day of July 2019 to be Comic-Con International 50th Anniversary Day throughout San Diego County. David, thank you so much for coming down and thank you for what you do for this region. Think about it, 50 years ago, few hundred people, basement of a local hotel. It was a basement of the U.S. Grand Hotel, 300 people at the very first event. Uh, we wanted to highlight areas of uh, art that we thought were art that other people thought of just as entertainment. And here we are so many years later. So many years later is 50. It's 50. I don't think anybody ever thought we'd last this long. We're happy that we're here. And now we welcome people from all over the world. Glanzer told me even in its infancy, Comic-Con organizers thought if we can just get people through the doors, they'll come back and bring their friends. And have they ever. Meaning outgrowing the convention center, which Cox brought up in our interview with him. And we're just so happy that they just signed a, an agreement for another three years through 2024. Uh, we hope the convention center issue uh, moves forward in a positive vein because I think that could be an impediment in the future if uh, it isn't passed. At the County Administration Building, Ed Lenderman, KUSI News.